Tonight, Somalian government officials confirming a regional leader of the Al-Shabaab extremist group has been killed in a raid. The assault came one day after the announcement of the death of Falmouth native Senior Chief Kyle Milliken. And Milliken was killed during a raid in Somalia just days ago. Many are honoring and remembering Kyle Milliken with deep roots in the Falmouth community. Others are recognizing the sacrifice Navy SEALs make by putting their life on the line for their country. They are truly our heroes. Um, they are the superheroes of the country here. A community mourning the loss of Senior Chief Special Warfare Operator Kyle Milliken. He was killed in Somalia during an operation against the extremist group Al-Shabaab. Milliken was from Falmouth, Maine. Michael Cates runs Camp Sunshine. He knows many Navy SEALs who come to the event to help fundraise. He says he doesn't know Milliken, but he knows the sacrifice SEALs make for our country. Working firsthand and seeing the SEALs in action, I've had the opportunity to see the, the pride and dedication that they have for the country, uh, for the community, uh, and their willingness to make the ultimate sacrifice to keep us safe here at home. Falmouth Police posting a very detailed tribute to their hometown hero, a man who dedicated his life to protect his country. The post says someone doesn't just fall into being in the military and certainly not a leader or commanding officer on SEAL teams. Milliken obviously had a calling, a calling larger than himself. That post goes on to say his accomplishments while living speak to his character and motivation to live, love, fight and succeed, even if that meant dying to do so. And it ends by saying to the Milliken family who shared an incredible young man with an entire world, your hometown recognizes and appreciates this more than we can ever express here.